Temporary trail closures. I didn't say anything. Well, we're gonna go play around on this trail. Because everywhere else is either closed or drained. Went out to Ravenna. It's raining steadily. So, we're gonna go to Strongsville again. But, I'm gonna go down this out and back loop. With all these cool features. So, hopefully, that'll be exciting. Not real good at skis, but there's a pretty good one up here with some consequences. <laughs> if you don't make it, this should be fun. hit it the other day but it's one of those ones that's like way more intimidating not on camera but you gotta get across make it across the ditch <laughs> try to make it the other side I'm not gonna hit these because I don't know just don't but yeah one of those like commitment things it's super steep. Just gotta hit it. Whoo! <laughs> it's kinda sketchy. And uh actually leave my bike right here for a sec. We go back and look at it. It's like way steeper than it looks. My camera. But there's a significant ditch I guess you could come over here and do it but it's actually super sweet uh, little bridge and stuff it's pretty cool but yeah you could go in the drink too so it's fun Don't mess around especially when everything else is closed this trail's a little bit more like scenic to some extent. It's got features on it, so. I don't know if this is supposed to be like more of a challenging loop or whatever, but it's fun. A little warm up loop before I go hit the other trail. If anything, those coolest places relatively close to home, and it's challenging. Oh, here's another one kind of sketchy, looks old. <laughs> the tire just like pulls you around where the hell it wants to go. The bridge. Anyway, out on the bike, it's fun, it's all good. It didn't quite go as planned, but whatever. Just not enjoying it. Another little bridge, kind of. Oh, God. Have a nice place to work on your ski.
kills. It's out and back loop. Just gotta be careful. Somebody might be coming the other way. Gotta be heads up. Oh. The first day I rode this, it was super slick. And it's tough. There's all these rocks. But today it's dry. It's amazing how much it was raining, like 30 miles away. Like steady downpour. But here it's beautiful. Got a level high. Step off, kind of. Try to jump that. There's a pretty decent step off back here. It's pretty good to practice on. Definitely when you gotta like hit right or you're over the bars type thing. I'm back. Oop. Man, this skinny right here. I don't know what you're supposed to do. It's like you're supposed to step off to this, to that. Or maybe it broke or something. I don't know if you can see that. It's like, I don't know. It seems a little above my pay grade. At least stepping on and off that thing. At least by myself in the woods. I mean, I'm sure it's not too bad. It's not like you're gonna fall that far. But I'm riding so low today for the norm. It's all good. Uh, black diamond, hunting for diamonds. Always looking for black diamonds. Here's another one. Don't look too bad. It looks like there's a rock garden to a step down. I'm not sure exactly what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to just jump off of it. Because that would scrape your pedal, I would think. If you... I'm not 100% what to do with this. You could probably just roll over it, I don't know. If you need it, dude. Oh. Nope. Uh, you'd probably make it. I don't know about being on the bike, though. It'd probably be better to just jump it, launch off it. So, again, by myself. Probably save that for another day. Because we are back in the woods where it seems like it's not a super popular trail but uh it's a cool feature i don't have any bash or anything on my bike either hurting my pretty carbon frame with that rock doesn't seem super appealing 
I'm sure uh, it wouldn't be too bad, but hey, that's it. There's other features. Ooh, geez, that lock rock is not stable. And I don't know if something was built up on top of that. It's hard to tell. It seems like some of the stuff's kind of run down. But bigger features like that, I'll save it for with a buddy or something. Uh, try to ride smart. I mostly do this for exercise. So it's not like I'm out here trying to change the world on a mountain bike. That feature wasn't very big or nothing, but it was decent. Uh, enough to where I do it with somebody else. At least the first time, just to figure out what's going to happen. Oh. Cool river creek down there. Pretty neat. There's a cool area back here. Yeah, last rock roll feature or whatever it is. It's not as intimidating as like other things we've ridden. But it's uh you know. I don't know what was black down about that? Here's some rocks. Oh here's that step off. Oh I could do that smoother. Go back and hit that again. That's no good. There's a step off right there. Pretty neat. Come up here. Get a little more speed. I kind of just rolled off that thing almost. Yep. Yeah. But yeah, that's about it. Nothing too exciting. Go back and show you that step off. Oh shit. Almost fell off my bike. It's stuck in a rack. But it doesn't look like much a lot of times on camera and stuff, but these drops are pretty decent. I mean, that's, you know, a foot or two drop over a sketchy log, you know, landing. So they're fun. Great little practice one because it's not super high consequences, but your bike's not going to roll over that. So it's cool stuff. Got this guy's way. Oh. Go back and hit that one more time. Oh. Riding the schedule features on the way out. Figured I'd show you. Oh. Try to find a spot for you. Sorry about that. Right. Hardcore guy. Hardcore biker. It's on that out and back trail. We're gonna attempt to ride through the ditch on the way out, just see if the bike will do it, or what will happen. It'll be good. Gonna try it, gonna get up the other side. Looks like they built some rocks on it, 
so you can do that. I'm not sure. Fuck it. Oh yeah. Oh god. Tire spot. <laughs> That's steep. I don't know if you can see it, but pretty steep. Yeah. All good. So that's a finish of the red trail. Yeah. All good. Gonna ride some others now on the way. Out. 